Welcome back to another THMB layout update. This is a November edition. Uh, the reason I'm showing you the panel right now is that I run into a little problem with uh, power for the tortoise switches and the panel or the lights, LEDs. I had a 12 volt 500 milliamp powering this panel and that panel over there. On that panel I had about uh, nine switches and this panel has about six plus the LEDs and what I found that after running them for a couple of days or more than a couple of days I should say about a week or so of constant running with the LEDs and the tortoise switches I found that the uh, transformer shorted itself out. I guess the uh, current is too much for the transformer. So I upgraded to a bigger and better transformer. And here it is. This is... Come back. Focus back. 12 volts, 1.2 amps. So I replaced that and now that is just powering this panel here and then I'll put another one to panel, another one to uh, power that panel. So that should work much better I believe. We'll see. I'll keep you posted if I have any other problems. So that was one of the problems I found. I should say the only problem I found with my transformer and I corrected it and we'll see what happens from with that. Now back to the layout. Nothing's changed over here. The Helix, West Hamilton. I got a little bit of fascia up as you can see. The panel will be work, working over here. I got special guests in the uh, Hamilton yard. And nothing's changed over here, and we have a structure in the middle of the room, framed up, and that's going to be our dispatcher's room. So we'll have the uh, dispatcher sitting in here, controlling everything from here. We'll have the uh, signals and the detection on the uh, computer board all wired up. And over here we have trains running underneath the staging yard. Now I have a complete loop. I have a one track all the way around the staging. So you can go down one helix, go underneath the layout on the staging part and come up on the other side of the layout. And that takes about 15 minutes to do. And back over here, I don't know if I showed you, before we have signals. And these signals will be uh, thrown by the dispatcher. And then we have the rest of the layout over here completed. And there's the other helix, and we have the track underneath. And we have the train in the helix, going down. We just had our layout tour, and I ran this whole layout all day, and to my surprise, there was no problems whatsoever other than just a few cars derailing here and there that's just because of the power or I should say that cars weren't properly checked and that was the only problem we had and now what you're looking at is the second part of the helix and that will be going up to that height 
which will be over here for Smithville. Once we get it all done, we should, we're should going to be up here. There will be another table on top, and that will be Smithville. And that's all we have for updates, so let me know what you think. If you have any questions, comments, please post it. Mark, like it, please, if you like it. And uh, I'll keep you posted on uh, the progress as we go. And uh, from here, let's see some trains run on the layout.
she'll be all right. Welcome to Teach Me Layouts. <laughs> 